In this video, we'll be taking a look at three NHL games happening on December 16, 2022, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So two picks for each game, six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three NHL games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive betting picks to take your sports betting journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer anywhere from one betting pick a day up to 10 betting picks a day and much more. Now let's get started. Chicago Blackhawks vs. Minnesota Wild The Chicago Blackhawks face the Minnesota Wild with both teams heading in opposite directions to start the season. The Blackhawks have a 7-16-4 record and are in last place in the Central Division while the Wild have a 16-11-2 record and are on a three-game winning streak. Both teams are looking to improve within the Central Division and the Western Conference and the upcoming game looks to be a good one as a result. The Blackhawks are 18-39 in their last 57 road games and 14-37 in their last 51 overall. The Wild are 61-25 in their last 86 home games and 7-2 in their last 9 overall. The over is 9-4 in Blackhawks' last 13 games playing on zero days rest. The over is 8-3 in Wild last 11 overall. The Blackhawks are 1-5 in the last 6 meetings in Minnesota and 0-6 in the last 6 meetings. The favorite is 7-0 in the last 7 meetings. The Chicago Blackhawks travel north for a one-game road trip against their division rival, the Minnesota Wild. The Blackhawks have had some issues lately, as they only have one win in their last 13 games heading into Friday night. The Wild are trending in the opposite direction, however, as they are perfect on their current four-game homestand and looking to move up in the Central Division. Not that the Wild needed any more advantages in this game, they will have one thanks to scheduling. The Blackhawks played the night before at home against the Golden Knights and will be on their second game in as many nights. Defensively, there is no confidence the Blackhawks can stop the Wild attack. In the past month, the Blackhawks rank last in goals allowed per game with a mark of 4.5. This high number of goals allowed can be attributed to the amount of scoring chances they allow, as they rank 31st in expected goals against. When you look at the Blackhawks' offense, there isn't much there. They rank last in expected goals as well as rank 31st in goals per game since mid-November. And on top, they will be going up against the top-ranked team in the wild in expected goals against. And you struggle to find how the Blackhawks will generate offensive pressure. Look for the wild to dominate a bad, tired Blackhawks team. So the Minnesota Wild to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full-game side pick. The Wild have been playing very well on offense recently. Minnesota scored three or more goals in eight of the last 10 games. Kiro Kaprizov leads the Wild with 36 points and 17 goals. He has recorded one or more points in nine of the last 10 games. The defense and goaltending have both been awful for the Blackhawks this season. They rank 27th in goals against per game and 29th in shots against per game. This season, the over has hit in 10 of Minnesota's 16 home games. Minnesota will score on Chicago and the over will hit. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. St. Louis Blues vs. Calgary Flames The St. Louis Blues will go on the road and take on the Calgary Flames at Scotiabank Saddledome. St. Louis has a record of 13-15-1. Calgary has a record of 13-11-6. Both these teams faced each other three times last season with St. Louis winning two of the three matchups. The Blues are 7-3 in their last 10 versus Western Conference and 2-6 in their last 8 overall. The Flames are 6-2 in their last 8 home games and 0-4 in their last 4 overall. The over is a 11 to 4 in Blues last 15 overall. The over is 5 to 2 in Flames last 7 home games. The Blues are 4 to 1 in the last 5 meetings in Calgary and 6 to 1 in the last 7 meetings. The favorite is 38 to 16 in the last 54 meetings. St. Louis will be fatigued in this contest as they are on the back end of a road back to back. Calgary will control the game. The Flames rank 4th in shots against per game while St. Louis ranks 21st in shots against per game. The offense and goaltending have also been very poor for the Blues this season. They rank 23rd in goals per game, 25th in shots per game, and 29th in goals against per game. The Flames have received good goaltending this season. They rank 15th in goals against per game. The St. Louis Blues continue to pile up the losses with a defense that gets blasted nightly, and these things usually don't improve on the road. 
The Calgary Flames are due for a bounce back performance and they're at home with the rest advantage, which typically helps. This line is what it is for a reason, so the Calgary Flames to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. A whopping 32 goals have been netted during the last four contests between St. Louis and Calgary. The Blues have already cruised past the set goal mark in 12 of their previous 16 overall outings, averaging no less than 8.25 tallies per encounter. Five of the most recent seven domestic fixtures of the Flames, meanwhile, have all been filled with plenty of markers, posting an average of eight strikes per game. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. New York Islanders vs. Arizona Coyotes The New York Islanders have somewhat slowed down in recent times, but still remain one of the deepest and most talented teams in the NHL, and in the second of a five-game road trip, they'll head west to take on the Arizona Coyotes, who may not look like much, but have certainly been playing a fun, tough style of hockey as of late. These teams are certainly on different trajectories in 2022 to 2023, but when they come together, with all of the goal-scoring talent on the ice, it's bound to be a thrilling contest, even if, on paper, Paper, this one looks like it could be a one-sided affair. The Islanders are 1-4 in their last five games playing on two days rest and 2-5 in their last seven overall. The Coyotes are 15-38 in their last 53 home games and 16-36 in their last 52 overall. The under is 11-4 in Islanders' last 15 Friday games. The over is 5-2-2 in Coyotes' last nine games playing on two days rest. The Islanders are 5-2 in the last seven meetings. The favorite is 18-6 in the last 24 meetings. The home team is 18 to 6 in the last 24 meetings. The Islanders have been a very good team for several years now, and unsurprisingly, they've dominated this matchup against Arizona with a 5 to 2 record in their past 7 meetings. And while the Coyotes have caused some massive upsets as of late, including Boston less than a week ago, the Islanders are still a solid pick. The New York Islanders usually don't string together losses, and they've had a great deal of success against losing teams over the years. The Arizona Coyotes just can't get out of their own way due to a defense that's absolutely awful, and playing at home hasn't helped all that much. The Coyotes have made betters money this season because of these inflated lines, but they're hard to back from day to day. The favorite between these two head-to-head -head has taken 18 of the past 24 meetings as well, so the New York Islanders' money line is our full game side pick. Both of these teams possess elite goal-scoring ability on some levels, with the likes of Barzil, Keller, Lee and so many more, but overwhelmingly, everything points towards the under in this one, with the under being 4-0 in the past four meetings between these two, as well as a 7-0 marker in the past seven meetings in Arizona. For the Coyotes, the under sits at 6-1 in their past seven meetings with the Metropolitan Division, and for the Islanders, the under is 4-1 in their past five meetings against teams with a losing record. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyze. Subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.